wow. Just wow. You know who I am. Your eyes are currently tuning in to the Blackbuster Show. And the time, you all know what time it is. I shouldn't have to remind you. It's the anti Xbox One news. Now, there have been a lot of negative rumors about Microsoft. Just to throw some past you guys, in case you don't know, Microsoft was rumored to have paid off Kojima, not to show up for Sony. They were rumored to have paid off third party developers and publishers, not to show PS4 games at E3. There have been tons of negative rumors about Microsoft this entire generation and every E3. But because it's Microsoft and because we're fully aware of the things that they've done in the past, we believe it. And it's more than likely that these stories are true. Because this is how Microsoft rolls, people. But what we have right now is an article from GoNintendo.com. And it's merely a rumor. It's not confirmed. And they do have a picture which can be taken out of context. But what we're going to do is analyze the picture just a little bit to see if we can try to, you know, try to understand where they might be to see if this might be true. Because what I'm about to tell you does sound like Microsoft's work. Now, essentially what's going on is that Nintendo has booths at Best Buys across the nation. So people can go to Best Buy and play Wii U games. And demo games. Essentially what's happening is that Microsoft is hiring employees to go to the Best Buys to question people who are waiting to play games at the Wii U booth at Best Buy. You know, stuff like, why are you excited about the Wii U? Hey, Xbox One is coming right around the corner. Why don't you consider that instead of a Wii U? And things like that. There was someone in the comments area of that article who states that he was in Schaumburg and there are two Microsoft reps there, one in a white Microsoft t-shirt, like in the picture, the other not in uniform. They were talking about people, they were talking to people in the event, why they were excited about the Wii U and taking notes. One uniform guy was on his Microsoft Surface and the non-uniform guys seem to be typing stuff on his Windows phone. And when I say taking notes, I mean there was a document up on the surface titled something like Nintendo E3 Experience at Best Buy and there are paragraphs being typed. Microsoft. What is the point of doing this? These people are there to play Nintendo games because they like Nintendo. They want to see what Nintendo has to offer. Because they know about the event, you know, regardless, I'm pretty sure they're pretty aware of what happened at E3. Sure, there could be some people that are going in there, you know, just to go to Best Buy and they just see the booth and want to play a few games, yeah. But a lot of people who are going to these things are people who know the event is actually there. So they're fully aware about what's happening in gaming right now. So I'm pretty sure they have plenty to tell you about why they want the Wii U, you know, rather than the Xbox One. But I know one thing you couldn't do at such events. You couldn't convince these people otherwise. Why did you pick an Xbox One over a Wii U? Because when your own vice presidents and when your own heads of whatever department you guys have, when these people that are interviewed by gaming websites and gaming journalists, every time they try to explain something to us, they goof up. Because there is no justification for what you guys are doing. There is no excuse. There are no benefits. You cannot sway us one way or the other when it comes to Wii U, PC, or PS4. No one that's interested in those platforms is going to go for the Xbox One. Now, let's just take a brief look at the picture that was posted on Go Nintendo, supposedly taken from the Best Buy where the event is being held. Now, here we have a picture with a black dude in a Microsoft t-shirt, and it looks like he's looking at someone in the crowd, talking to him. Now, we can't really confirm that it's Best Buy, but if you look over to the right side, you will see 
Mario, Peach, Luigi, and Toad. And you'll see a sign there that says, come play right underneath it. And it says Wii U. Now, there are plenty of places that have Wii U demos. But this could be Best Buy. Especially if that sign is actually advertising the Wii U booth for E3 for Nintendo at Best Buy. So this picture, while it doesn't confirm anything, at the same time, it does make the story more plausible. So just take this with a grain of salt, guys. It's not confirmed, but to tell you the truth, I believe it. Because I know what Microsoft has done in the past. They have done these crazy things in the past, trying to bogard and gay crash on events for other platforms. And they do, you guys have seen them do this. Remember when the PS4 launched? In London, there was a PS, I mean when the PS3 launched, excuse me. In London, there was a PS3 launch party. It was by a river in London. And guess what Microsoft did? They hired a boat to say, Xbox 360 loves you. And had the boat sail up and down the river throughout the entirety of the party. At different, you know, websites, we have heard that Microsoft has sent them gift baskets for reviews. Over at CVG, they sent CVG tons of beer bought with the price difference between the Xbox 360 and the PS3 at launch. So we know Microsoft is fully capable and well known for pulling off things at events and pulling off things to try to bribe people to say positive things about their platform. So I'm going to tell you right now, I believe this article. However you take it, that's you. I'm just reporting what they have on here and trying to make sense of it. But anyway, this is the Blackbuster Critic. You're watching the Blackbuster Show. And stay tuned for more anti-Xbox One news. Y'all have a good day. Hey guys, Blackbuster Critic here. I just discovered something else that could possibly confirm that that picture definitely did come from Best Buy with, in fact, a Microsoft employee talking to people in line. Now, you remember that picture over there with the Mario and the Peach and Luigi? That is the exact same picture picture that they used on Nintendo's E3 website for the best buy locations and times and dates where you can go to a best buy and play Nintendo games. Coincidence? I think not. I do believe that's a best buy and I'm sure that that's exactly what Microsoft is doing. That's a little bit more information I discovered as I was editing this video. Y'all take care and have a good day.